Okay, so here we are, step three, global settings. And we get here by, in this example, I'll use local folder. It remembers the last location of the file, of the image folder. Click next, and so here we are. So here we are. You can add a new profile. If you've got a new project, you would click on that button and name that project. You can delete a previous project or you can rename a profile and you will rename a profile because often with projects you're targeting different keyword phrases at different times so you will create a profile and then copy it and call, name that one number two for example so I'll go ahead and pull up an existing profile all this data is saved in the profile read the first image and last image order and random and number order I'll go into that on the next window of the software after clicking next for now, I will describe what first image text is and last image text. Whatever information you put on here will be overlaid on the first image and last image that the software attaches to your video. And what's important about that is the duration that we set down here. So the process that Hangout Millionaire uses when it creates videos, it creates a video from Instagram, local image folder or local video folder, it turns that into a video and then to give us the best variation or duration of that video we the software adds a slide at the front of the video and at the back or at the end of the video to make sure that our videos are unique from each other we the software selects a random number between what you put here we'll go three and seven so it will make one on the video and the duration of that slide on the front of that video will be randomly chosen between three and seven seconds. The same on the image that we attach to the end of the video. Personally I like a longer duration so the longer that image is at the, at the end of that video the longer it puts off the suggested videos popping up and it also gives you a call to action that is presented in your last image time to sit there. So I'll, I'll go 15 to 25 and that means after the video that you've created is played it will play the last image that the software attaches to that video for a random amount chosen between 15 and 25 seconds. Every time it produces a new video it will choose a different random number between 15 and 25 seconds. If you're using a blank last image you would put a call to action here in text and then and then select the image color to suit that background additionally you can rename that profile and we'll call it So now we have two profiles, both of the same content, but towards the end of going through the Hangout Millionaire process, on the last window you can put a different range of keyword phrases in there to target if you like. If you prepare custom first and last images, this would be blank because you've got that text already written in those images already. And the last part being the image duration. If you're producing a slideshow video from Instagram or local image folder, the duration of each of those slides presented in the video are chosen randomly between these two numbers. Why this is awesome is it produces different duration videos and also helps to produce different thumbnails in the Google search results. So these are very flexible. Two to four is typically what I use. Though you can make them longer, though remember the, lo the more seconds you use, the longer the videos, the longer the process is to create the videos and broadcast them, etc. On to the next video.